Okay, Coach, uh, general comments on the game? You know, you don't want to jump down uh, 21-7 like we did. You know, two turnovers in the first half is not how we want to operate, but I thought the guys, you know, gathered themselves and really did a great job right at the end of the first half. Um, second half, you know, we were better defensively than the first, but we got to be cleaner offensively. I thought we executed pretty well. You know, ran the ball for 277. That's a pretty good day. So, you know, generally pleased overall. Just, uh, just plenty we need to clean up. Questions? So uh, you kind of touched on it, but if you could talk about that defense early, do you think a uh, start like that is, is concerning uh, despite having come back? Sure. Yeah, it's, it was very concerning. Um, yeah, I mean, we got to do a better job out the gate. You know, first play of the game, I think they ran the ball. It was their longest run of the day. Um, 18 yards. And, uh, you know, then that was defensive end didn't spill the uh, tight end and get the thing, you know, to hit east-west. You know, we're allowed to hit north-south and you can't do that. So, you know, just from that and then, you know, we, we have to do a better job of defending the pass. Um, you know, that was going to be, you know, if they were 7-13 on third down, uh, that's, you know, we can't allow that if we want to be successful. Um, you know, so we have a pretty good offense. We got to do a better job of getting teams off the, off the field on third down and getting uh, – getting the ball back to our offense. And you talked about the ground game too. What do you think of Snead's performance today? He was great, you know, with the exception of the fumble. I thought both those guys, Trey and uh, Julius, uh, and Trey Wilson was great to get Trey back. Um, you know, the, Trey ran for eight yards carry and Juice ran for nine and a half. So it's hard to find a lot of fault with, yeah. uh, with those type of days. But, you know, we... Uh, you know, it's good to see Trey bounce back from the first half fumble, and obviously it's good to see uh, Dak and, and the guys on offense stick with him. So, you know, he's our captain, one of our leaders. And along with that, uh, Lockford and Snead, you know, really crucial running talents, rushing talents uh, this game, but in general, what's the value been for this team to have two really great talents at the running back? Well, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, the, they can, you know, ideally they never really get tired. And, you know, Trey's at 15, Julius is at, at 11. So, I mean, that's not a... a Tremendous workload. So if you know if we can kind of keep them in that twenty to, you know, both of them in that kind of ten to twenty carry category, you know, especially with Trey Wilson back, you know, I think we'll be pretty good. You know, Timmy ran the ball pretty well too. Yeah, it was that that touchdown at the end. What did you think run. of that? Great run. Yeah, you know, great run. Twenty-seven yard run. And I asked uh, Tim the same question. Uh, ended at the end of the second quarter. You guys kind of took over after the tail of two quarters, right? Uh, how do you avoid being overconfident? Um. Good question. Uh, I mean, that's kind of the trick week to week. And we talk a lot about modesty, being humble, you know, really just playing to our standards. And, you know, we have standards as a program, we have standards as a team. And that's really what we're focusing on every week, you know. So it's not so much the score or the yardage or anything like that. It's, you know, did we meet our standards and, and did we do what we feel like we need to do to win football games? And that's that's really it. Yeah, and along with that, this season has been you know a lot of up and down games, uh, a lot of close games. Was that something you were definitely trying to avoid this game? <laughs> <laughs> if we could win them all by uh, seventy, that'd be great. Yeah. Uh, but obviously, you know, unfortunately, the opponent gets a vote too. And when you're picked, you know, one or two in your league, you're always going to have a bullseye on you, so you're always going to get everyone's best effort. So. You know, we have to be, you know, be be ready for that. I mean, you know, Georgetown, heck, you know, uh, they do a great job down there and, and quarterback played a good game. So um, credit to them. You know, they gave us everything we could handle. Um, you know, Pierce played a great game. So we just got to, uh, we got to learn from it and move on. Yeah. And uh, is anyone who, you know, knows football, uh, leads are fragile to, to hold on to. So what was the motivation for running up that score at the end and, and you know, keeping your foot on them? I guess. Uh, well, I mean, yeah, I, I don't know if we ran it up, but yeah, I mean, you, you always just, it, it, it's, you know, 21 points, game's in range. So you have to, uh, you have to keep playing, you have to keep fighting. Um, you know, and they had onside kick, so they're trying to still come back and, and compete. So, you know, we're going to try and get one more score to where we feel like we put it at a, at a place where it's out of reach. Um, 
you know, so, but, you know, that last drive, we kept the ball on the ground. We didn't kick the field goal or anything like that because we felt like it was pretty well in hand. And obviously we didn't want to, we didn't want to uh, insult anybody. Um, but, you know, I mean, it was a competitive game right down to the end. I mean, they moved the ball really too well there at the end. And, uh, you know, we have to do a better job. Yeah, and if you could just touch really quickly on Georgetown's receiving uh, receivers that game. I mean, especially early on, they were kind of having their way. What did you think about that? How would you lock down on that? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, Josh uh, and Ken Creighton are good. They're really good players. You know, Moultrie hurt us out of the backfield. That was, you know, the first one was a um, guy, uh, guy lost coverage of him, poor eyes. Uh, added on to the blitz, didn't seem to leave. Um, yeah, we knew we came into the game knowing seven and two were really good players. Uh, you know, we, I think Brandon Spencer went in, did a really nice job. I think Kemper did a pretty good job. Um, and then, uh, for the most part, Stevie Williams kind of buckled down in the slot and, and our safeties did a better job uh, on those guys as the game progressed. And I think, you know, a little more pressure up front, uh, maybe not as comfortable throwing the ball, uh, and we were in decent shape. And so to conclude, what are you looking forward to next game and what are some things you're taking from this game that you're going to carry over? Well, you know, I mean, it's going to be a good a good fight, another conference game, a really good team in Lehigh. Um, it was really well coached and they played really good defense and, and you know, gave us a heck of a game here last year. We had scored 21 in the fourth to beat them. So we're going out there, playing on grass. You know, it's, it's, a, it's going to be a challenge. So... Yeah, I mean, obviously, we're hoping to continue to the run we're on offensively, but defensively, we have to do a better job against the pass. We can't give up uh, 395 yards passing or whatever it was. Yeah, 395 yards passing and uh, expect to have sustained success. Well, thank you, Coach. Appreciate it. Congrats on the win. No, I haven't. Hey, I guess, Tim, just you know, general comments on the game. Uh, proud of the way we play on offense. Off offensive line played great. I think we had over 270 rushing yards. That's always nice. We're pretty... Pretty well balanced. Um, coaches had a good game plan. Receivers played great. I kind of just went out there and executed the game plan. Okay, questions? Uh, yeah, uh, could you talk a bit about how you felt you performed specifically? Oh, uh, I thought I did fine. I thought I did okay, honestly. I didn't, you know, missed a couple throws, I think. One to Fotis, but um, I just think this offense, you know, makes my life really easy. I think I get a lot of credit, but I think... The coaches deserve a lot of credit for game planning all week and um, making my life easy, giving me simple reads. And uh, obviously, when you run for that many yards, it makes my life easy. And then I have great receivers to give the ball out to. So I think, you know, I played okay. Yeah, so it was a bit of a shaky first quarter, uh, but then y'all y'all picked it back up. There was a play in the second quarter, turnover in the end zone. How do you brush those kinds of things off? Uh, does that get to you? No, you know, I don't think it gets to anybody. I think uh, we always talk about the only people that can stop us is ourselves, and drive killers do that, and obviously, I don't think we punted the ball today, which is a good thing, but we had two turnovers, which obviously kind of hurt, so we got to clean those things up, but I think there's no panic with everybody, and you know, we came out strong in the second half, for sure. Yeah, and, and even before the second half, you guys uh, you had a, a nice takeover towards the end of the second quarter. How do you avoid being overconfident entering into the locker room at halftime that can, that can get to you, so... Yeah, I think you just got to stay um, stay calm, stay pretty even keel. Don't get overhyped. Or if you're down in the game, don't get down. Just kind of know that there's a whole second half of football still to play. So everybody's got to stay locked in and focused and just continue to execute the offense. And uh, relating to you guys had a tough loss to Ohio last week. How important was it to get such a big win, and especially running up the score like that? How important was it for morale? Yeah, it definitely helps. I think, you know, I know I was. I think our entire offensive team was itching to – get out there and play this game to kind of forget about what happened last week with that with that game so you know, I thought we come out uh, we came out and played well as a team and you know definitely a good win for sure thank you that's all I have okay, <laughs>